Lesson 7.7 .7 is adding and subtracting fractions. And I'm first going to go over how to add fractions. Um, what I tell the kids is to put their um, fractions vertically and add them. That way we're going to start with our fraction. I'm going to add my 2 eighths plus 3 eighths equals 5 eighths. And then add my whole, which is 1 and 1 equals 2. So my final answer would be 2 and 5 eighths. It does not need to be simplified, and so I can move on. Another example is going to be 1 and 2 fourths plus 2 and 3 fourths. And so for this one, starting with my fraction, 2 fourths plus 3 fourths gives me 5 fourths. And then I have 1 plus 2, which equals 3. Now what I should have the kids notice is that this 5 fourths is greater than a whole. And so I want to take out the whole and put that in with my hole that I have over here. So I'm going to take out 4 fourths, which equals a hole, and I add it to my 3. So that equals 4. And then what I would have left, 5 fourths minus 4 fourths, is 1 fourth. And so then that goes with my final sum. I was supposed to add. So as you can see, even for an addition problem, sometimes you will have some subtraction um, when you take out the whole. Another example, 4 and 5, 6 plus 3 and 3, 6. 5, 6 plus 3, 6 gives me 8, 6. And 4 holes plus 3 holes gives me 7. Again, I should notice that this fraction I could take out um, 6, 6 and add that to my whole. And so I'm going to take out my 6, 6, which would leave me with 8 holes. And I have 2, 6 left over. Now, I told the kids they can leave this, but they could or should notice that 2, 6 could be reduced or simplified. So I divide by 2 on the top and the bottom, which leaves me with 8 and 1 third as my final answer. Moving on to subtraction, it's much easier because you normally won't have to take any of the fraction and um, convert it into wholes. So starting with my fraction, I have 3 sevenths minus 2 sevenths, which gives me 1 seventh, and then I subtract my um, wholes. 6 minus 4 is 2. One more example, 8 and 4 fifths minus 5 and 3 fifths. That leaves me with 1 fifth. And then I have three left here. So again, subtraction is a little bit easier um, to work with.